My name is Adam Ilya, and I'm the Command Historian of the 25th Infantry Division at Schofield Barracks, Hawaii. I started with the 25th Infantry Division back in August 2000. I was actually working uh, for a few years as the museum technician over at the Division Museum. Uh, I, that's how I got into the government system. That's how I started working for the Division. Uh, I worked there for about five years and in April 2005 when the Division Headquarters first came back from Afghanistan on its first GWAT deployment, um, they had a position for a historian come up and so I applied for it, I got accepted and I came up to the Division in April 2005 and have been a historian ever since. You know, during the global war on terrorism I deployed uh, three times with the division headquarters, all times to Iraq. That was in 2007, 2008, and 2009, and 2010 to 2011. And uh, I was in the staff in the, in, in the headquarters. I went out on a lot of what I called embed missions. So, you know, I went out and actually stayed with an organization for a few days to kind of observe what they did and conduct some interviews. Uh, the organizations that I stayed with ranged from uh, a small military transition team that was stationed just outside of Saddam Hussein's hometown of Tikrit. Uh, to working with the brigade headquarters, uh, staying with them for a week and see how they conduct operations. And I often went on um, battlefield circulation missions with the commanding general when he met high-ranking officials. Uh, the role of civilians in the global war on terrorism, I, I don't think there was a lot said about them, but there's a lot of civilians, DA civilians and contractors that you know went out and served, uh, served the U.S. military uh, during the global war on terrorism. The role of civilians I think is incredibly important. It's a very important aspect of how the Army operates. Uh, you know, our role is really to support the warfighter and to ensure that they get their mission done as best as they possibly can and get the mission done, period. And that's what we do, and that's what I try and do and help the 25th Infantry Division as a historian.